As a sophomore, you have two choices for English. The first option is English 2. In this course, you will continue your study of world literature through reading, writing, oral language, and technology. Your second option is Honors English 2. Students will explore world literature through science fiction, poetry, nonfiction, and short stories. One unit of popularity is the study of the author Edgar Allan Poe and his various suspenseful stories and dramatic poems. Students enrolled in Honors English 2 will also read a major work by William Shakespeare and analyze his masterful style. Writing is a core focus of the curriculum as well. If you're excited about writing and literature and are looking for a challenge, consider Honors English 2. The math department has many options for juniors and seniors. Everything from intermediate algebra to AB calculus is offered. Taking higher level math classes shows you have problem solving skills and can earn your college credit at the same time. If you are currently enrolled in Algebra 1, your next class will be Geometry. If you are currently taking Geometry and doing well, your next step would be to take Algebra 2 or Honors Algebra 2. If your plans include taking Pre-Calc Trig in the future, you must enroll in Honors Algebra 2. If you decided to take Regular Algebra 2, you should plan to take Algebra 3 the following year rather than Pre-Calc Trig. There are a wide variety of science classes for you to take at Wichita South. Whether you like biology, chemistry, physics, the environment, plants, animals, or even crime scenes, there is a class for you. Here is an example of what your science teacher will show you in a class in a few days. This chart shows all of the recommended science classes you should take at each grade level. As a freshman, you are taking either biology or honors biology. As a sophomore, you can take one of five classes, Global and Environmental Science, Botany, Zoology, Chemistry 1, or Honors Chemistry 1. Here's some information about each of these classes. Global and Environmental Science studies the relationships between organisms and their environment, with the emphasis on interrelationships among plants, animals, humans, and the environment. It is the study of how individuals and societies utilize resources and influence the environment. Botany is the study of plants. In this course, students learn about living plants, their life cycles, and their evolutionary relationships. Zoology is the study of animals. In this course, students make comparative studies of animals, the niche they occupy in their environment or habitat, their life cycles, and their evolutionary relationships to other organisms. Be prepared, you will have to dissect animal specimens in zoology. Chemistry 1 studies matter. This course involves studying the composition, properties, and reactions of substances. Topics include atomic structure, chemical bonding, chemical reactions, chemical formulas, acids and bases, and nuclear reactions. If you are at or above grade level in math and reading, you should consider taking Honors Chemistry 1. Similar to Chemistry 1, this class better prepares you for advanced classes in biology, chemistry, and physics. If you have any questions about your science enrollment, please ask your science teacher or visit with a counselor. They are always happy to help. At each grade level, there's different levels that you can take. You can take regular, you can take honors, or you can take AP, which is a little bit more advanced. At each grade level, the speed will increase, so which means it'll go slow, medium, fast. Now, if you're not sure which one to take, you can go ahead and ask your history teacher.